So sit with your feet flat on the floor or on a block and chair behind you but not slouching against the back of the chair. Try and sit up nice and tall. I want you to have a visualisation of your tailbone lengthening down towards the floor and the crown of your head stretching upwards. And just pull your tummy in gently, not too tightly, but gently, and that also helps to support your lower back as well as tone your tummy muscles. And just rest your hands on your thighs, tuck the chin in very slightly so you're not tensing your neck. We're just going to inhale, shrug the shoulders, exhale, drop them. Go in, out. So when you shrug the shoulders, shrug them as tightly as you can, and then just let them drop. So breathing in and out through the nose. So it's light, like sniffing, but it's a definite breath. So I should be able to hear you. As you exhale, feel your tummy muscles tighten, as if you're literally trying to blow your nose. Now your shoulders might start to get warm, it might start to fatigue, so we hold a lot of tension in our shoulders, a lot of emotional tension as well. So when they start to get warm, as mine are doing now, that's good, because we're working towards an energetic release. So don't give up now, even if your arms feel like they're getting tired, your shoulders feel like they're getting tired, keep going. The more energy we put in, the more we get back. And to keep your belly button drawn in, you can do this. You've got about another 10 seconds, I've got faith in you. Shoulders up, hold so you can squeeze even tighter, squeeze as tight as you can, and let them drop. And just close your eyes for a minute. You might feel a nice warm glow across your shoulders, your neck, your chest. Because it works on an energetic level, not just on the physical level. We store emotions in our body, and when our, those emotions get trapped, that's when we end up tight and tense, or we can end up becoming literally becoming ill. And still sitting up nice and tall, belly button to spine. Just allow your chin to drop to your chest. And I want you to try and relax your head as much as possible. Now we often think you're relaxing our head, but I can assure you, you're probably only about 40% relaxed. So each time you exhale, I want you to think to yourself, let go. Let go. We're so used to holding our head up that it's actually quite a challenge for us to completely relax our head. But as you start to relax it, you'll feel a stretch along the length of your spine. So as soon as you inhale, keeping your tummy drawn in, make sure you're not slouching. So it is just literally the head you're relaxing. And each time you exhale, it should be your chin coming closer to your chest. Think to yourself, let go. And just start to very gently move the head a little bit side to side, just a little bit to start with. Again, you might feel those neck muscles very tight. And each time, just going a little bit further. But keep your awareness to make sure you're not tensing your neck. I'm going to gradually start to bring the ear up towards your shoulder. Inhaling one side, exhaling to the other. And this time you're going to circle the head all the way around, but as you go back, Think more of lifting your head up rather than letting it drop back. So just lift the chin up, just let it drop forward 
but don't let it drop all the way back. Just lift the chin as far as feels comfortable. And when your chin comes to your chest, change direction. And round the other way. Just notice if one direction feels any different to the other direction. You might notice a bit of clicking and grinding, that's usually all right. You can drop your chin to your chest, interlink your hands, and rest your hands on the back of your head. And notice that increases the stretch. So just be aware that you don't suddenly tense your neck muscles in response to that. Let your head be heavy, arms be heavy. Again, notice the stretch all along your spine. Make sure your spine is nice and upright. Then draw your belly button in. And then the next inhale, press the elbows nice and wide. As you exhale, completely relax the arms. So it's the weight of the arms, but drop the head forward. Inhale, lift up, open the arms, press the elbows back. Exhale, forward. As you come forward, just be careful that you're not rounding over. So it is just the head and neck. Inhale, press back. Exhale. Relax the arms. So it's the weight of the arms that are stretching, that are bringing your chin to your chest. Your belly button to spine, spine nice and tall. Just a couple more. Inhale, open. Exhale, relax. And once more. And just relax here again. And release the arms. And slowly float the head back up. But still sitting up nice and tall. Just bring your fingertips onto your shoulders. Try and have your elbows nice and high, but without tensing your shoulders. You can inhale, open the arms out. As you open them out, palms up, fingers spread out. Exhale, touch your shoulders. Inhale, open. Exhale, touch. In, out, in, out. And then just check you haven't sunk into the chair. So imagine pulling your belly button in towards your spine. But also imagine sliding your shoulder blades down away from your ears so you're not tensing your shoulders. Inhale, exhale. We're working on an energetic level as well as physical level. Really spread your fingers out, stretch out the skin on the palms of your hands as you extend the arms out. I know your arms might be starting to fatigue, but you can do this. I have faith in you. And every time that you do something you never thought you could do, Build inner strength as well as outer strength. You've got about 10 seconds. You can do this. I believe in you. Get that muscle fatigue that you're feeling is an energetic release. Open the arms out and then see if you can slowly. I know you just want to drop the arms but slowly lower them down. Again, just close your eyes, keep the shoulders relaxed. Just notice how your arms feel, might feel tingling and heat in your arms, how you've woken up the energy. Look for release in your shoulders. Awesome. And bring your hands onto your knees or thighs. And inhale, lift your chest. Exhale, round over. As you round over, allow your tailbone to tuck under slightly, almost as if you're slouching, as if you're about to fall off the back of the chair. So inhale, pull your arms towards you a little bit, and lift your chest, exhale round. And in, out, in, out. If you can't quite go as fast as I'm going, then go a little bit slower. Head stays still, and it'll move a little bit, but don't think about moving it. And just visualize your spine. And you've got x-ray vision. You can just visualize your spine. 
and you're just bending it. We just want to make it more like a bending pipe cleaner and less like a broom handle. Even if it feels like there's not much movement to start with, that's why we do these exercises. And every time we work with the spine, we're actually influencing the whole body. Because our central nervous system runs along the length of the spine. So we improve our immune system, we improve our digestion, we improve our energy, as well as our mobility. Get strong breaths in and out through the nose. You need to go slower. You can go slower, but just see if you can go a little bit quicker. You only got about 10 seconds. You can do this. You can. I know you can. And you'll feel so good afterwards. Inhale, lift your chest. And relax a little bit. You might feel some warmth up through your body. Fantastic. We're still sitting up nice and still, still drawing the belly button in. Inhale, reach the arms up. Try and reach them up without tensing your shoulders. Then as you exhale, take both hands to the side of the chair and turn and look over your back shoulder. Inhale, stretch up. Exhale, twist the other way. Again, just check that you're not tensing your shoulders. We're trying to keep the lower body still. So if you feel like your lower body is wiggling around, gently squeeze your knees together. So from the side, looks like this. Twists are so good for your whole body. Bring mobility into your spine, also gives your inner organs a little bit of a massage. Again, still drawing the belly button in towards the spine, that helps your lower back. You can do this, I have faith in you. One more each side. Now reach up, stretch up, spread the fingers out, take the arms out into a kind of V shape. Imagine you're trying to reach to each corner of the room. Soften your shoulders, breathe, nice deep breath in. Full breath out. Imagine like a balloon when it fills with air, it starts to lift away from the ground. You can do this, two more breaths, in and out, soften your shoulders. Once more, deep breath in, fill your whole body with breath. And breathe it all out. And gently and slowly as you can. Again, I know you want to drop your arms. Slowly lower them down. Yeah, just take a moment just to notice how you're feeling right now. And just place your hands over your heart. And just thank yourself for taking this time. I'm so pleased for you to join me. I love sharing these videos with you. I love hearing from you. So please let me know how you feel after practicing this. And if you know anyone who you think would appreciate this video, then please, 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 please share it. Namaste, enjoy the rest of your day.